Welcome to Country Car, my name is Tom. Here we have a beautiful BMW 1 Series. This is the 118D, however it is a 2 litre. It's an M Sport. As you can see it's absolutely stunning. Privacy glass, gorgeous BMW alloys. I think my favourite feature is probably the M badge logo that just goes through the grille there. really is an amazing looking car. Let's have a look in the boots. Good sized boots. Those rear seats also fold down as well, giving you even more space. Got the floor mats there, as well as a parcel shelf. Plenty of space inside for your passengers. Two-tone interior, which in itself it's very soft, very well made with it being a BMW. So it's keyless start. So all we have to do is have the key on our person. I'll pop it in there for now. Put your foot down on the clutch. Press the start button for a couple of seconds. Just above that start button is the start stop. So if you the traffic lights and the car turns itself off to save fuel, you press that button it stops that from happening. Dual zone air conditioning with this lovely digital display. We have various modes of the car, sport mode, eco, pro mode. Basically what that means is your sport sort of stands for itself, gives you a bit more play in the power. The comfort mode and then eco pro. Now this is going to look after your miles make sure that you're driving as well as you can do and these blue 0, 0.0 that's the amount of miles that you're saving so I'm not saying an awful lot because I'm just sat here at the moment six speed manual gears with this lovely M badge that's coming across there just contrasts throughout the whole of the car makes such a difference to the appearance this blue trim that comes across there as well media interface so we've got Bluetooth auxiliary on top of that you've got your radio which is AM and FM and then down we've got a few nice little added things we can do for example the climate we can set that let's say I wake up at well, 5.52 in the morning early riser. I can set that timer there and it will stop the fans going for me even when the car's locked and I'm still tucked up in bed. Nice armrest there with your USB and your auxiliary ports and a bit of storage there as well. Owner's manual pack inside the glove box. So you've got a speed limiter here so that means if I wanted to set my speed see that green thing just moving set it to 70 for example then the car will stop me from going over 70 if I don't want that to happen I simply just turn it off so it is a multifunctional steering wheel here we have the volume and we can switch to the auxiliary port using that there and then various other things we can do including changing the radio station using the steering wheel. Front and rear fog lights. Electric windows with a nice little function there which is the lock window function. Got the kids in the back that keep playing with the windows. Lock that down. It's just fantastic looking car it's almost like bucket seats they just they hold you in they grip you extremely well and on top of that they you won't be able to see it from the video but you can actually adjust these and make them tighter so if you want to fit in nice and snug you can adjust it to how you like it I will say it also smells fantastic in here I can't see that anybody's been smoking or had any pets in here this blue stitching that comes across the seats as well. So if I have a look under the bonnet, bonnet latch is just here, you pull it once to open it and then instead of there being a safety catch underneath the bonnet you simply pull it again 
and that releases that safety catch for you. Another really nice feature here is this, this little cushioning here. You can tend to find that your, your knocky knee on the side there, where they've, they've put that there so it's a bit more comfortable for you. It's surprising how many times you notice that whilst driving. Um, and if you haven't got a car that uh, doesn't have that in, you'll probably notice the fact that your knee does tend to bang against that occasionally. So, under the bonnet then. Very clean engine bay. The car's had 160 points inspection with us already. The car goes on the ramp, we take videos of the health of the car, photos of the health of the car. Check it mechanically, sorry, as best we can. Then after sale, we do that inspection again. If we needed an MOT, it's a third party company that does that for us. From your perspective, that's another pair of hands to scrutinise the car, making sure you're getting the best of the best. We give you three months for a thousand mile, full parts and labour warranty. That comes as standard, however, you can extend that up to four years. 300 or 500 pound a year, depending on the level of cover you wish to take out, of course. If you've got a part exchange, we can help you with that. Looking for finance, we can help you with that as well. We've got very competitive rates. We're open seven days a week. Our number is 01926 267813. This car fits the bill for you. Give us a call. Thank you.